Hey there everybody, I'd like to welcome you to another play session of Nothing But Gwent. In this episode of the next two episodes, I will be doing nothing but playing Gwent. So if Gwent's not your thing and you'd rather not watch me play Gwent, you're going to want to go ahead and skip ahead to episode 323. But for those of you who would like to watch me play Gwent, and I know there are some of you out there, stick around. Uh, I think um, the first thing I'm going to do is uh, we still need to play Stepan in Oxenfurt. And I think. Um, is there a quest for that? For playing Stepan? Let me see. Velen players. Nope, he's not here. Collect them all. Nope. I thought we had a, a quest for Stepan playing Inkeeps. Here we go. Win Stepan's unique card. Let's make that our current quest and uh, see how far away he is from us right now. Oh, he's right nearby, actually, so let's just run over and uh, play Stepan. I, I can't remember whether we already played him. We may have played him once before and lost to him. I, I, don't, I don't remember. But uh, hopefully we've got better cards now, and hopefully I've learned a little bit of something. Oh, I don't think I get in this door. It kind of bugs me that the... The game is uh, telling me to go in that way, and I can't even go that way. That's okay. We'll just run around here. We'll go in this door. And Stepan is right in here. Now, it's been a while since I played. I feel like I might be a little rusty. So we'll see what happens. Hey, Stepan, what's up? Oh, I remember you. What'll it be? What'll it be? Well, let's play Gwent. A round of Gwent? Why not? But you know my rules. High stakes, always. I'll play on your terms. Alright, I guess we know his rules. Um, oh, okay, neat. They show the faction perk up here now. I don't think that was there before, so... Uh, I Let's see, my Nilfgaardian deck has a unit card strength of 138. My Northern Realms also has 138. Skoyatel, I'm 126. And Monsters, I still don't have a complete monster deck. Um, let's see, win whenever there's a draw, draw a card from your deck whenever you win a round. I kind of like playing with this, uh, as Northern Realms. Um, and let's just stick with Northern Realms and we'll see what happens. Start the game here. Opponent's leader cancels your leader's ability. What? What was that? Why did it say that? Scorch, Impenetrable Fog. I don't think I need this card in my hand, although I don't understand why he said that his leader negates my leader. Because my leader does this. He plays this card. I don't quite understand why it said that. I guess we'll find out. Kind of makes me wonder if I shouldn't keep this in my hand, but... Shoot. I don't know. Um, this guy isn't really worth a whole lot unless he has somebody to bond with, so I'm going to trade him in. Okay, we went up a point there. I think I'm going to stick with this hand. Uh huh, okay. Let's stick with this hand. See what's going on here. Alright, Stepan goes first. He's going to play that wimpy card. So it's my turn. Right here. Yeah, I can't play this card. I don't. Oh, that says leader ability. Cancel your opponent's leader ability. Okay, I'd never heard of that one before. Okay, that's fine. Well, I guess I'm glad I kept this card, though. This card here sets the strength of all ranged combat cards to one for both players. So that's what he he just played a ranged card. So maybe I'll stick away from... stick away. Stay away from ranged. Maybe he'll play a bunch of ranged cards and then I could use this. So let's go front line here. And we'll see what he does in response to that. Okay, so he just he just goes ahead and plays Biting Frost right off. Um, so... This would be a good time to play this card, right? because it would only give him one point. So I'm going to play this and get two cards. So screw you, pal. You screwed yourself. Now what are you going to do? Oh, okay. What the hell is this guy doing? Why would he play this card and only get one point for it? It seemed kind of stupid to me. I 
hesitate to play, I don't like playing the highest value card on the table because then you could scorch me. Um, but my only other option is to play this one. And like I said, I don't really want to go in the middle because I want to save this. So, and this isn't going to do me any good because this will let me choose a card from my discard pile and I don't have any cards in my discard pile so there's no sense in playing that. However, if I throw this out and he scorches it, then I can play it again. So let's just see what happens. Okay, he didn't scorch. Hmm. Unfortunately, I don't really have anything else that goes in the back row. I could play these. They won't be affected by the... Uh, Biting Frost. Um, well, I mean, I've got them. I might as well use them, right? I don't know if I'm being smart here or not. I'm hoping I'll just scare him away. Okay, there goes his Scorch. So he Scorched this guy. Now I can throw this out and just pull that card right back out. Basically just say, screw you, pal. There you go. How do you like that? How do you like them apples? Huh? Okay, so he's staying in the middle. I'm just, I still have way more points than him. Um... Hmm. I mean, I could throw this out and really screw him. But I'm already ahead of him. But... Um... Kind of curious to see what he's going to do. Hmm. I feel like I have too many special cards now, you know? Um. I mean, I could go ahead and throw this out. And say the heck with this. Could do that, and then maybe save this for another round. But what are the odds that he's going to have a lot more of these cards? I don't know with him. Let's see what he does. Okay, now what are you going to do, jerk? Yeah, that's right. You're going to pass. That's what you're going to do. Alright. So we beat him this round. Quite handily. Okay. One round one. I have three more cards than him. I like that. Okay. Let's uh, go ahead and go to the middle. Okay, he's going to pull somebody out of the deck. He pulls the spy card out. That was smart. Give him two cards. Alright, we're going to stick in the middle here. He's got a long way to go if he's going to come back and beat me. Oh, he's going to pull another card out of his deck. That's a neat card. Okay, alright. Nice move. Who is this anyway? That's a Yennefer, that's a Yennefer card. Neat. I don't think I have that card. That's pretty cool. Um, okay, so I'm up by one. Hmm. I don't, I don't know. He's got four cards left. Uh, if I throw out a Scorch, I'll get rid of this card. It might be my only chance to use this card, so I'm going to go ahead and throw this out, I guess. Well, no, I don't have to, there's no rush. I could go ahead and throw this out, and he'll still have the biggest card on the table. Okay, let's see what he does. Ooh, a 10. Ha ha ha. Well, you know what I'm going to do now, I am going to scorch that. So the heck with your card, buddy. Okay. Scorch that. We both have three cards now. Oh, crap. Man, he's got all kinds of those cards to pull more cards out of his deck, and he just pulled it right back. He did the same thing to me that I did to him last time. Oh, crap. He's only got two cards left. He's five ahead of me, so I think I have to throw this out. Oh, this is bad. I have to, I have to win this hand, because I don't have enough points for next time. He's got two cards. I'll be damned. He's got another health card. Holy crap. So now we're tied. 
I can't lose this. He's got one card left. And it's a four. And we tied. And I and that's his He'll win this he'll win this hand. He'll win it. I'll be damned, he beat me. He'll beat me because it's a freaking tie. Damn it. He wins the round. And guess what? This one's also going to end in a tie. And guess what that means? He wins this round. Well, ain't that some shit. Damn. Oh, that sucks. Why does that look so weird? Why does that screen look so weird? Huh. I'll be damned. Well, that Perhaps sucks. Perhaps you should come back when you've got a better deck. Or when you learn to play. Oh, you've... Oh, you... You've made me angry now. Well, we're gonna play him again, right oh, off. I remember you. Mm -hmm. What'll it be? Yeah, yeah, jerk. Play Gwent again. A round of Gwent. Why not? But you know my rules. High stakes, always. I didn't notice how many coin, how much coin I lost to him last time. Let's try the uh, Nilf, the Nilf Guardian deck. I guess we'll use the same deck he's using. Let's see. My special ability is what? Torrential rain. Man, I can't believe how many of these health cards he had. Good grief. Well, I call them health cards, what medic cards, that's what they are. Man, I mean, he just kept pulling them out. That is powerful, you know? I don't really think there's anything I could do about that. It's like... It's like he's got extra... all these extra cards in his hand, you know? I have a couple here. One, two... Just those two, really. Damn. Um, wow. Yeah, well, let's uh, try this, um, I guess, I don't know, I kind of liked my other deck better. I don't know what's so great about this deck, really. Th so this deck, I've got a Scorch, I've got, oh, this is a cool card here, I like this card. Uh, Dandelion's not a bad card. And I have all these tens, let's see what happens. Of course I have these ones too, let's see what happens. So he canceled out my leader ability. Of course, that cancels out his leader ability too, jerk. Okay, decoy. I'm gonna keep these for their um, medic ability. This guy's not really worth a whole lot if he doesn't have anybody to bond with, so I'm gonna trade him in. That was a good trade. And this guy here, uh, I've gotta have something better than that in my deck, right? Look what I got. Good grief. Alright. I have to go first. So I've got one, two... I don't want to use these this round. Oh, look at all these back row guys I've got. Let's just go in the back. Hope that he doesn't have a... What is it? Torrential Rain? Okay, good. He did the same thing. Okay. Throw this out. Okay, so he's going Spy already. Now, I don't like that. Now he's got more cards than me. I would rather have more cards than those four points, to tell you the truth. Don't like that at all. Um, let's go ahead and throw this Wimpy card out, I guess. And by the way, as you're watching me play, if you see me do something stupid, or if you think there's something I'm missing, please feel free to give me some tips. I'd appreciate it. So he, he just gave me nine points, but he has 11 cards. Good lord. I'm gonna decoy and take this card in uh, because I, I need to get some cards. And I've already got plenty of points. Biting four, I'll be damned. So he throws that out there. I still have more points than him. And the cool thing is, is that now when I throw this out, I'm only giving him one point. So I'll get two cards back. Oh my gosh, those were some crap cards. Why do I keep getting this damn card? Except that now, I can tight bond with him and that doesn't really do me any good since he's frozen. I guess maybe I'll save this for next round and I could revive those two guys, maybe. Um... So if I throw out Scorch, I'm going to get rid of my own card, but this card too, so I don't want to do that. 
Um, do I throw this out? Let's try this. Now he throws the damn torrential rain. Well, son of a gun. Ouch. Man, how hard do I fight to beat him? Right, right now I could throw out Scorch and that would get rid of that card. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> Six to two after all these cards that have been played. So he's just gonna revive that card. I should have known better. But I made him I made him use another card. Is that good? I don't know. This sucks. This sucks so bad. <sighs> Still only one card behind him, and I do have these. The only card I have in my discard deck is this Scorch. <laughs> I don't think I could revive a Scorch card, can I? Choose one card from your discard pile and play it instantly. No heroes or special cards. I'd say that's a special card. So let's go ahead and throw, them out, throw him out here. He's not affected by the rain. Man, now what's he going to do? Okay. I'm still ahead of him, though. If I throw this out, he may scorch it, but then I could bring it right back. And I hate to throw this out now, but I feel like I'm at a point now where I have to win this hand, because if I win this hand, I'll get another card. So I have to win this hand to match him in cards, or get close to him anyway. He's got the Vesemir card, but that's not going to do him any good. What the hell, dude? He's still going. He's got five cards left. Do I just go ahead and pass and let him play out his five cards? Let's see if he could pass me up. I'm going to pass. Let's see what happens. A fog card? Okay, throws him out. Throws a decoy out. Pulls him back. Throws a spy out. He's going to get more cards. Throws him out. What the hell's this guy doing? Ah, shoot. That sucks. Oh my gosh. Oh, he doesn't have any discards. Is he really doing what I think he's doing? <laughs> he doesn't have any cards left. <laughs> he doesn't have any cards left. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was the stupidest thing ever. <laughs> oh my god, that was awesome. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I beat him. Ha <laughs> ha, screw you, Stepan. I don't like losing, but that don't mean I don't do it with grace. The card and the prize are yours. Nice. You've been playing a while. Gotta know where I can find some interesting cards. Yeah. In Novograd, there's Oliver the Innkeeper. He plays, though he's far beneath my level. Oh, really? Closer, in Velen, there's the barkeep at the inn at the crossroads. Hmm. Ooh, we got the Yennefer card. Cool. Nice. Okay, this quest is updated, I guess. Receive some experience points. That's it? Okay. Well, let's take a look at our cards here. So, uh, here's that awesome Yennefer card. Now, this is a neutral card, so we could put this on all of our decks. So, I'm going to throw it in my uh, Nilfgaardian Empire deck. Okay. I'm going to throw it in my Northern Realms deck. Nice. Throw it in my Scoyatel deck. Okay. And in my Monsters deck. <laughs> I actually have enough cards to play with the Monsters deck. Ooh, check this card out. When did I get this? Let's throw that in there, too. Alright. Nice. Okay. Well, thanks, Stepan. Okay, so if we follow along with this quest here, this playing in keeps quest. We are to win a unique card from the innkeep at the inn at the crossroads. And then find a unique card in the kingfisher. Now, I don't know whether I've already played this guy or not at the kingfisher. Where is the kingfisher? Uh, the kingfisher is over here. No, that's the crossroads one. The kingfisher is up here in um, Novigrad. Well, that makes sense. Um, 
So, I'm going to uh, travel up there, and uh, it looks like, we, let's see, well, there's one guy here, there's one guy here. I guess it doesn't really matter which one I go to. So let's leave his little establishment here. Oh my god, shut up. That is really annoying. Uh, okay, where is the fast travel point? Where is it? Fast travel point is over here. You can't spread disease. What? Okay. So we're gonna let's go to the crossroads. What the heck? Let's go over here to the crossroads. We'll do this one. In at the crossroads, and we'll see if we could beat this guy. Take whatever card he's got. Oh, I remember this place. Right here. Save. Uh, where is he? I see a marker on my mini map here, but um, I don't see the innkeep. Not one of the barons, men, are you? Where the hell's the innkeep? He should be right here. Uh. Where the hell is the innkeep? Maybe I should send him to the creek. Farmer's I wife. Um. Okay, this is weird. Where is the innkeep? 